Y254. Imagine. Welcome back to the program. My name is Yvonne Anula and this is Business Highlights. Now, Christmas holidays come with a lot of excitement. We want to try new things that we've not done before with money that we do not have. Tonight, our topics revolves around the holiday budget. We want to find out how we can be in a position to save money as well as be in a position to spend wisely during this period. And to see us through this topic tonight is Maina Azimio who is a financial wellness consultant, a serial investor, and an entrepreneur. Remember, you can be part of this conversation by tweeting us, beginning with the word by news at Yvonne Anula at Y254 channel. The hashtag to use is Y254 updates. Maina, when I, I heard of this topic, the first question that landed in my mind was, do I really need to get budget for this? Do I really have to have budget for my holidays? Thank you, Yvonne. And uh, it's true. Mm -hmm. Money you don't spend before you plan for it. Mm -hmm. A budget is not a very big issue. It's a list of what you intend to do mm -hmm. with the money that you have. Mm -hmm. You don't plan for spending money you don't have. So we normally look at what is our income and the money we have saved. In the fact, the money we are going to spend over the Christmas, mm -hmm. holiday, New Year, mm -hmm. it's money we have been saving throughout the year. Ah. So every month you save a certain amount of money towards mm -hmm. your December expenses. Because mm -hmm. this is the longest holiday. And people overindulge. Mm -hmm. So we knew that Christmas will come as early as January. So what have you planned for? If you have not planned, don't spend. How easy is it for me to come up with the amount that I want, I want to use for, like Christmas? It's important to first get down and list the things that you want to do. Mm -hmm. This is a time of having fun and enjoying yourself and uh, feeling good. Mm -hmm. And it is important to feel good. But you have to do it in a responsible way. So the question we ask ourselves is, what can I afford? Mm -hmm. So it is more of affordability, not what you feel like doing. Because even if you know it's good to fly home, mm -hmm. but you cannot be able to fly to Mobasa, mm -hmm. you can take SGR train, mm -hmm. or you can take a bus, or you can hitch a lift. Mm -hmm. There are many ways of getting, but you still get Mobasa. Mm -hmm. So the question is, how much money have you saved mm -hmm. for this December? Mm -hmm. And let's plan for it so that it's able to make you feel that you have enjoyed your Christmas. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Most young people are um, emotional about this festive season and at times I find that I, I bought a dress in December and in come January I look at the dress and I'm like oh my god I could have used this cash to do something else sure that is that happens not just the young people alone mm -hmm. even us mm -hmm. at our age mm -hmm. we also do the same mm -hmm. in fact Kenyans we are emotional spenders mm -hmm. we spend to just feel good mm -hmm. for the time being and this is why nobody call for delayed gratification. Mm -hmm. You delay the gratification because you make mistakes when you allow emotions to guide, guide your expenses. Exactly. Resist. Mm -hmm. Make sure that uh, you plan for your shopping mm -hmm. much earlier. Ah. I advise people that uh, for Christmas mm -hmm. shopping, mm -hmm. especially clothes and shoes, mm -hmm. do it in October ah. before the mood has caught up. Because mm -hmm. this mood actually is the one that comes with emotions. Mm -hmm. Choose what kind of a dress you do want to adore yourself with during Christmas okay. and New Year. And plan and buy it earlier on. Mm -hmm. But don't. So what are some of the mistakes that young people tend to make when it comes to budgeting for holidays? Thank you. Young people mm -hmm. have a problem of wanting to show that uh, even them they, have, they, 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 they have made it. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> and it is just putting a show. Mm -hmm. So I would advise you mm -hmm. and the young people like you who are listening to us mm -hmm. to resist the temptation, ah. to want to please other people. You do so much to please people who you don't like and they also don't like you. You are not going to get any advantage by showing them that you have arrived. Mm -hmm. So the point is, are you digging your grave and have a suffering year 2019 mm -hmm. or are you spending responsibly now mm -hmm. and live a better life in 2019 i advise that 2019 is more important than mm -hmm. just a few hours of fun exactly yes now how do i prioritize between needs and wants in this season we 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 have it in mind that 
for parents, the kids are going back in school in January, mm -hmm. but still we need to celebrate as a family mm -hmm. because it's a holiday for us. For you young people, because you have no kids, you're taking it to school, first and foremost, you, also, you have a, f a budget. Mm -hmm. January is the longest month. Exactly. Now we have already been paid or we have paid the, our workers to go on holiday. Mm -hmm. They'll be coming back in January. Mm -hmm. Already they have got the money that they are going to spend over the holiday in January. Have you paid your rent here? Have you made <laughs> arrangement for your transport? If you drive, do mm -hmm. you have enough money to fill your car? Or have you kept aside your bus fare mm -hmm. to come to work? Because January month is very long. Mm -hmm. And there's no money. Everybody is broke. Yeah. So you must make sure that you have enough money mm -hmm. which will take you, keep you going mm -hmm. over January unless you're on leave. Uh -huh. If you're on leave, you're lucky. Yeah. Are you coming back in January? Of course. Then you have to pay your house rent. <laughs> you have to keep money for your bus Exactly. Fare, and your lunches mm -hmm. when you're here. And again, you won't go to saloon. All this is money you should first remove from your income, the mm -hmm. money you have. Pay those bills before you travel home. Mm -hmm. Or you go for holiday, wherever you want to go and enjoy your holiday. Mm -hmm. Do not be tempted yeah. to spend first, then come later to think, what will I do? Mm -hmm. with my, And if you owe somebody any money you have not paid, yeah pay it now mm -hmm. before you go because the person who has been patient waiting on you mm -hmm. also need to have money Ma for Christmas exactly so be good to them by paying them off mm -hmm. if you have got anybody who have been assisting you pay them off mm -hmm. the retail that remains is what now you should enjoy ah. but don't spend before you have done those key uh, things <laughs> okay remember you can still be part of this conversation by tweeting us, beginning with the word Y News at Yvonne Anula, at Y254 channel, the hashtag to use is Y254 updates. Now, Maina, yes. uh, what is the number one thing you'll recommend for people to stop overspending or to avoid overspending? Any expenses mm -hmm. that you are doing, not that because you had planned for it, mm -hmm. or is a need, as mm -hmm. you have said, need and wants. Mm -hmm. A need is a need, mm -hmm. like now transport. Yeah. But again, it depends on how you want to get home. Mm -hmm. Do not go for instant gratification. Yeah. Try to minimize your expenses because I can assure you, mm -hmm. December is a very long holiday. Mm -hmm. Like now, it's beginning on Friday. Mm -hmm. We are going to come back in January. Mm -hmm. So those are more than 12 days yeah. of spending without working mm -hmm. and without earning. Mm -hmm. So I will tell people, do not engage into any unplanned for activities mm -hmm. because if you had planned for it well and good mm -hmm. but then anything is good because it's a holiday and it's a break what happens what happens in the case of solving miscellaneous like items or services do i need to budget separately for that no not don't have separate budgets mm -hmm. list all of them mm -hmm. and the point here is if you have not planned for it mm -hmm. don't spend on it I advise people like now you young people, uh -huh. what I have learned over the years, uh -huh. how I have been able to solve the problem, mm -hmm. I look, I list down all the things that I'll do. Mm -hmm. I divide my money and put it into envelopes and write on top of it. Mm -hmm. It's for clothes, I write clothes. If I want to buy any gadgets, if I want to buy any presents, mm -hmm. if I want for transport, I will not change money that belongs to the envelope for transport and use it to buy presents. Thank you. Now that I don't want to use money that I had kept for some other things or I don't want to overspend, is it okay for me to get a loan maybe? Loan? <laughs> no, the loan is, that is strangulating yourself. Mm. Do you know, by the loan, mm -hmm. it's living tomorrow's life today. Mm -hmm. What will you do when tomorrow comes? Don't borrow money which you're not investing to make more money for you mm -hmm. for expenses. Yeah. They are called consumption, consumer mm -hmm. loans. Don't resist that temptation mm -hmm. because it will become a bigger burden on you mm -hmm. when you'll be paying it to be very painful. Mm -hmm. So resist that temptation mm -hmm. at any level. So how can I be in a position to budget within my limits? Very good. Mm -hmm. You accept yourself for where you are. And in fact, you normally have two lists in life. Uh -huh. The list of what is possible uh -huh. and what you aspire for. What you aspire for is good because it makes you work harder mm -hmm. to increase your income so that you can afford them. Mm -hmm. Like now, let's say this year you are going to Mombasa. Mm -hmm. It is good to go by air. Yeah. But you can't afford it. But I want to try that. Uh -huh. It's a new thing, definitely. I yes. want to try it. Very good. Try <laughs> it. But budget for it. 
have you put money aside for it? Mm -hmm. Because you should start planning now. If you have not planned for it this December, I advise you, Yvonne, mm -hmm. don't do it. Uh -huh. But because December will come after another 12 months next year, 2019, Mobasa will still be there. Mm -hmm. Kenya Airways will still be there. Exactly. Even with better planes. <laughs> Resist, you know, what to practice what we call you know, uh, instant gratification. Mm -hmm. And you can plan for it in uh, 2019. Mm -hmm. This time, take a train or take a bus yeah. or drive there, even hitch a lift. You still be in Mobasa uh -huh. and you'll actually have a better time because life does not end in January. Mm -hmm it becomes more difficult. Mm -hmm. So what is the use of having fun for only two weeks, yeah. then you start crying. Ah. Yeah. Uh, you, Maina, you've had cases of young people. Now that it is festive season, mm -hmm. I want to go at my grandma's loaded. Mm -hmm. I want to show everyone that I can actually buy you a drink. I can actually buy you, buy you a new dress. I can do this for you. I can do this for you. Show I everyone. can give you 50 shillings each. Mm -hmm. What happens in such cases? Show everyone. Mm -hmm. This is the problem. Show yeah. everyone. You have to make sure that uh, you do not do it for them. Mm. It is for yourself. Yeah. Do not want to please people at your expense. Mm -hmm. It's good to treat people, yes. Mm -hmm. It's good to make people happy. Mm -hmm. But are you overstretching yourself? <laughs> Resources do not increase. Unless now you have got a plan on how you are going to increase your income, mm -hmm. you cannot go spending before you make. Yeah. And that is a mistake we do. Mm -hmm. Those people you are making happy there and you are showing them that uh, you, have, you are doing good in Nairobi, they will not be part of your suffering when you'll be paying back. Mm -hmm. When you'll be broke here when you come back in January. Mm -hmm. By the time you get to 15th of the month, you have nothing. Mm -hmm. You are borrowing even money for food, mm -hmm. you for water in everything i will advise the young people do not get into that temptation allow yourself to focus on what is important mm -hmm. because there are two things in life yeah first and foremost are priorities yeah what is your first priority mm -hmm. needs mm -hmm. needs mm -hmm. then we come now to wants mm. we all have wants but do not spend on wants before you have met the needs yeah Always make sure that the money go to the needs first mm -hmm. before you go to the wants. Uh, you spoke about uh, saving for the budget or maybe budgeting mm -hmm. from as early as October. And I'm here thinking mm -hmm. vehicle prices hiked just the other day. Mm -hmm. Now, it seems like the money I budgeted for traveling won't be enough. Mm -hmm. What happens in this case? In that case, you'll have to remove money that you had planned to do other things to add into the transport kit because you have to travel mm -hmm. we know okay again another area in life we have got what is urgent and what is important Not, yeah, yeah. you always look at what is more urgent mm -hmm. so because you must if you have to travel home mm -hmm. ama to any destination you want to go you have your fun yeah you must first and foremost allocate money to for the transport mm -hmm. or you change the means of transport Mm -hmm. So if the means you're using mm -hmm. is more expensive, you can change and adjust. Mm -hmm. But otherwise, you, there's some factors which are beyond your control. Yeah. If fare went up, mm -hmm. what do you do? Mm -hmm. You go to bed. Exactly. Or you stop going home. No, I won't stop going home. And people are waiting for you at home. Yeah. So <laughs> what do you do? Do not buy that shoe. Mm -hmm. Use the one that you have. Mm -hmm. People will not even notice. Yeah. Do not get bothered mm -hmm. that uh, people are looking at you in so many ways. Mm -hmm. Be comfortable in your skin. Mm -hmm. Be you, do you be you? Mm -hmm. The problem we have is that we like wearing a mask, branding, wanting to show that we are more than we are. Yeah. And remember, the people down there in mm -hmm. the reserve, mm -hmm. they are not of any value to you in branding. Exactly. Please, please the people here mm -hmm. who you can actually who can give you a, a, a job. Mm -hmm. Like now you, I know you can become nini. You can be given some job uh, to MC, mm -hmm. or at least you can be given for entertainment. Those are the people you should target, not the people in the rural areas. Okay, Maina, as we wind up, uh, what should I consider while budgeting? While budgeting, you consider all the items you want to spend on mm -hmm. against the money that you have saved. Mm -hmm. And I would want to advise this. Start saving for 2019 Christmas mm -hmm. in January. Ah. Every month, save a certain amount of money mm -hmm. towards what you'll be spending in Mm -hmm. the next Christmas because mm -hmm. I can assure you your salary will not be enough to make you enjoy your Christmas if you did not save yeah 
every month for the 12 months that we have in a year, you have to save put aside a certain amount of money mm -hmm. that we call holiday kitty. Yeah. Keep on adding into it. Mm -hmm. But before you put the money aside, eh, mm -hmm. first plan where you want to go and spend your holiday. Mm -hmm. Plan the things that you will do because the amount of money you save per month mm -hmm. should add towards the budget for that time. Mm -hmm. Unless now things prices go up, like you have said that uh, transport went up in October mm -hmm. because of uh, budget and other issues, uh, the, the bill which was uh, put in, which you did not envisage, mm -hmm. you should be able to plan how you are going to spend your holiday now. Mm -hmm. Then start saving every month. Mm -hmm. And again, work harder to create extra income mm -hmm. which will feed into your holiday spending. Okay, Mina, I understand there are a lot of holidays in a year. Mm -hmm. Now, let's say there's a holiday in February. Yes. I've started saving in January. Mm -hmm. When I'm done with that holiday, am I supposed to start saving again in February for the other holidays or what happens? In fact, when you are budgeting mm -hmm. and planning, you know, budget comes after you do planning. Mm -hmm. During planning, you first recognize all the holidays which are there. Mm -hmm. In fact, apart from now, like the holiday which we are given when during elections, yeah. there's no holiday which is not in the calendar. Mm -hmm. Even, I know what you are saying, February. February is not a holiday. Mm -hmm. Valentine's Day is the not Valentine's a holiday. Ah. <laughs> so Valentine's Day, but it is a calendar. Mm -hmm. And we spend money during Valentine's Day. Yeah, exactly. So the point is, we know there will be a, that time for spending in February. Mm -hmm. We know during Easter there is holiday. Yeah. We know first May, first mm -hmm. June, mm -hmm. October, mm -hmm. and December. Mm -hmm. Unless now another holiday, then we also know Idifitri, yeah. the, the Islam holiday. Mm -hmm. So you list down all the holidays mm -hmm. that we have in a year. Then when you start saving, identify where you want to go for each of those holidays mm -hmm. and what you want to do for yourself and for other people. Mm -hmm. So after you identify that, do a costing. Okay. Then that costing is the one that determines how much you save per month. Okay, thank you so much.